All right, let's begin. Time to kill many enemies. No regrets. Ooh, purple. You won't make any predictions today and ruin my stream? Ah. Uh... No, go ahead. Do it. Do it. Do it, I dare you. Just do it. Not word ranch. I may have stayed up a little late last night playing Stardew Valley. Not my stream. Don't ruin my stream. Alright. Let's get to killing, I think. So this isn't a key sanity, but I think I still want to keep track of the keys. Oh, hey, look. Nice moon pearl. Wow. This is just as good as yesterday's seed, I guess. There's one thing I would probably change about this, these settings, it would be starting boots or pseudo boots. Hell, even I would almost add a mirror scroll too, just things to speed things up a little bit. Two hour glove in common? Hell yeah. I took a look at some of the finish times, because there were, I think, nine other people that had played this seed. I think only one person had a sub two. Time to make it two. Ooh, bumps. Ooh, health. Whoop. Hmm. There we go. It's waiting for that to show up. Now I may walk back. Bum, 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 bum. You know what I want to do? I just take this and just like... I just want it to not be... so dang bright, you know? I think that makes it a little bit better. Yeah, most of my day so far has been sp spent getting ready for this. Look at me! Look at me! Eh, whatever. What? Oh, ha ah, ha! <laughs> Almost knocked that guy down the pit. Dude, we might just get... Just give me my other glove or my hammer, and I just have Dark World access from Hyrule Castle. Well, never mind. You were wrong. Okay, we're about to get key locked. Oh, where are we? Yes. Uh, eh, we'll 
hop into the back real quick. I also gotta remember what. Gotta remember to to blast some more enemies. <laughs> okay. All right. So I was right. It was Dark World access, just straight out the gate from Hyrule Castle. It's perfect. And with these keys, I could even backtrack a little bit. Just need to get one more. Very nice Hyrule Castle. It scared me. <laughs> Why is it so loud? Dad, why'd you scare me? Why'd you do that? What the hell's wrong with you? <laughs> What's up, buddy? Was funny. Well, you're right. I think what I'm gonna so I'm gonna have alerts and stuff turned on for the actual, you know, run. And uh, um, Daft did show up during Link to the Past yesterday, though. Uh, I think I'm just gonna have it muted, so that'll be easy. Isn't there... There's absolutely a torch right here. Yeah. Alright. Should be able to get everything out of here. Though I did kind of... waste a lot of me magic. Well, enjoy it while it lasts. Because at the end of the month, it's gone. get another chance for your for your memes to come back. Aww. Okay, I need some magic, because I accidentally... Oh, this room doesn't even carry the... No! I didn't realize that it wasn't going to carry the... I was facing up! rat right here in the middle. Oh, because there's still Zelda still. The idea that I want to do is that, um... There's really not that much on the way left to Zelda Sill. I'm gonna never do that ever. What I wanna do, I'm thinking, is that next month I'll give two spots away and then give Daft's spot to um, JR if he wants it. So I'm gonna have one on rotation for like mods. So don't worry about entering next time, JR. You get a freebie.
Yeah, I'm bummed for you too. I remember when I joined one of the Asyncs with uh, SMW and it didn't work. Daft's bit of the month. Bit him too. Okay, well, we got a lot of crap out of Hyrule Castle, which is good. Very good. I can work with this. Dan, I even got all the stupid enemies in the dark. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? Happy Friday. Yeah, there we go. Refresh. I'm hitting refresh. I'm scrolling down. Nothing happened. I'll try again in a second. Play all I do. Yeah, you're you're still you're working on 1.6, right? See you posting them spoiler to spoilers. See you over there. Up to 85 bucks for the Zooty Batuti Boss Shuffler. Listen, if you really want to make DT and I suffer, that's the one. Because otherwise, we're just going to have a great old time going through combo rando. Meal prep done. I did my meal prep. Got me uh, my madrinas all set up in the fridge. Oh, I'm ready. I'm ready, baby. My shirt? Nice. Made it myself. Chicken. I, I like what's what stopped me from just skipping all the light world dungeons I have access to, which is one more, and just go into the dark world. Hmm? I had two eggs and toast for breakfast. And then I had some leftover baked chicken and then a yummy side salad. That it's gonna tie me over until after our run tonight. I did it! Yo, what's up, Srop? Thanks for the double good luck. It's made from chicken and burgers. Mm, I might actually walk back up and go straight to the Dark World. Because how often do you get Dark World access this early? very slowly walking towards the dark world. Yeah, and let's just go do Skull Woods and try and beat it. Okay.
green eastern red desert. Been looking forward to this combo rando run later. I'm excited. Decided to put all the time and effort we, we put into learning the rando. Everyone's gonna think we're so cool when we just completely dumpster. That combo rando seed that I didn't, uh, I just kind of generated it and said, all right, there it is. Good luck. I thought about going through and like checking settings or doing stuff like that, but or not checking settings, but like trying to get a seed that's not completely ridiculous. But then I'm like, eh, it's fine. Huh? That's weird. Guess I'll go up and drop down. Get out of the way. Should have done this in the first place anyway. Okay. All right, there's a very good chance that this is not going to lock me in. There's a good chance I'm going to get at least one small key over here. Right? What's up, Nitro? Calls for a Bombos. Hey! Still no small key, but I'll take a bow. That means we can go be Green Potted Eastern. Gosh, is it actually going to prove me wrong? I got got. Right, I'm going to go straight and do all of Eastern for fun. I have a feeling about this. I can't believe I got got. Yeah, for people just popping in, we are doing a enemy drop shuffle. Big thing that means is that all the enemies in dungeons, caves, uh, have a random shuffled item on them. So, just means we're going to spend a lot of time in dungeons. What's up, unknown? Yeah, I'm, this is my killing time and raising money for our combo rando later. Because Drewski was looking for donation incentives for our run. And we didn't really know what to come up with, so we hit him with the uh, boss shuffle for combo rando. 
He slapped a $750 price tag on it and put it up on the site. My hammer, it does nothing. Eastern. You gotta have something, eh? Eh? Wish I had Ether. Ether is a much nicer medallion for clearing certain enemy rooms. Like that room. If you want to contribute to the charity, randomizer for good, rando for Nepal, you can type exclamation point charity. And that'll give you a link to some of the information you probably would like. The commands are all listed down underneath the tracker, underneath the timer. It's all for a good cause. I just bombos in this room just to make sure I get all the ding dongs that are in here. So there's what three in here, I think. Yeah. Okay, one of them dropped a key. Big key. Yeah, I figured that had to show up pretty soon. I guess I didn't need the door, Rando. Eh. It's fine. I'll be mad if I do all this for nothing. Hmm. So far, not so good. Don't tell me the bow out of Skullwoods was purely bait. Come on, just put like... I know I don't have a lamp, so some of this isn't in logic, but ignore that and just give me stuff. Oh, a shield. Yes. That's what I wanted. Damn it. <laughs> uh huh. This better be good. something. The booties. That's actually, like, that That alone is worth even if this dungeon's not required, like, this is going to speed up the whole game. Oh, man. I am quite happy with that. Of 
go, Boots. I've been having a lot of fun with the Stardew Valley Rando multi-world. I, um... I played for, I played until, like, almost 2 a.m. last night. Even though all that I had left in my game was, like, just a bunch of, like, small, grindy options. Which isn't great, but... Um, I couldn't resist. I wanted to play more game. But I think I was at... I finished roughly with 75% of my checks done. And I'm kind of... I'm not going to play... I'm probably not going to play... I'm not going to be able to play tonight because I'm going to be doing combo rando, but... Um, just kind of chilling, waiting for... Summer. Spring. One of the, the next seasons to pop up. Playing Sea of Stars? Nice. Hey, what's up, James? Bum, 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 bum. Welcome, welcome. Sea Stars is a great game. I did enjoy it. And I'm playing Unicorn Overlord. Nice. I have not played many tactics games. The ones I have played to completion were tactic Final Fantasy Tactics Advance when I was a wee lad and Triangle Strategy when that came out recently. I really like Tactics Advance. I think I tried to replay it recently, like maybe within the last year or two, and I just couldn't get back into it. Mini Shoot Adventures has been a blast. Nice, glad you're enjoying it. Alright, let's go get all of our junk out of Mini Moldern Cave. Who knows, maybe we'll find a 3 hundo and I can go see the Zor. I've played a bit of the original Final Fantasy Tactics, but haven't beaten it. It's one of those that if I play it, I'm gonna just spend all my time grinding way too much. It's almost a little overwhelming how much stuff is in that game. I never played Advance 2. I watched a stream of it. I feel, I, I'm guessing it was just more of the same, which, like, if you liked the first one, then you're probably gonna love the second one. Uh, it's... The thing I don't like about this mode in a non-entrance is it just feels like any check that isn't just B in a dungeon feels bad. Bonk. Owie! No. Yes. Yes! Got stuck on one of the last fights. I think the last time I played Advance, I figured out the best way to win the game. It was... Red Mage Summoner with double summons. It's cleared every room, like, in two turns. Yeah, it is a little weird. That's why I feel like it'd be better as a as an entrance shuffle, maybe. Because then you're, like, in the process of checking everything anyway. But that's the thing, it's like one single one-off check could have something um, super valuable. The best part of job system games is finding the OP stuff. Yeah. 
the thing with the Octopath is I feel like most of the time, at least from watching bits of the speedrun of the first game, is that the best way to win in that game is just to use the whatever character that has the uh, the hired help and just spend money to win every battle. I'm like, I'm not gonna do that. That's silly. Uh oh. Get back in the whirlpool. <laughs> That's scary. I'm trying to do a double stored water walk so I can potentially get the item on Zora's ledge. Because it's just a thing that I don't often get a chance to do, and this was just one of those opportunities. Island had a small magic. I checked it earlier on my way to Eastern. Wow, I can't believe it was nothing. Wow, I can't believe it was nothing. Unbelievable. I should go back to Skull. Let me go check a couple more stupid things and check my Dark World entrances. Or not, my Dark Hole prizes, excuse me. Tenet Pod, NTR, and Red Ice. Okay. Leave me alone. Best and cheapest viewers? Oh my gosh. Oh, you got him. Thanks. I love cheap viewers. Classic useless hype cave. No chest turns? Yeah, sorry, I was a little distracted. Um, I feel like I should just go to pod, really. Hey, you really gotta change how you wrap these seeds. It's like I'm going for, like, digging game. Dumpy. But at the same time, these could still have progression, you never know. That one didn't, though. <laughs> yeah, I feel like a lot of people are probably going to have late boots in this seed. Because who, who goes to Skullwoods, grabs Bow, and then bails for East for Green Pen at Easter, right? to go check shovel but i keep on not hitting the right route to do that my hope is that there's like a desert small or desert big on the torch now these boots are actually pretty required yeah we're gonna go back and finish the woods
Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Useless. Well, last chance. God damn it. Thank you, fairy. Very generous. There's the key I was looking for. Sure. <laughs> Get this shield out of here. how I'm going to do this section. I'm actually going to drop down from the back first. There's a lot of enemies in the back. I suppose. Nice tiger piggy. Take that. <laughs> Chat, DT said that if we uh, reach our boss shuffle goal, that he's going to wear his cool hat on stream. True. Do it for the hat. Oh, but DT, the hat, the hat. You got to think about the hat. This dungeon's had a lot of nothing. Double kill. Blech. Ah, it's a crystal dungeon we gotta do with. Oh, the bear belt didn't start. There it goes. Ow. 
Oh. Pretty nice. Scooby Doo. Scoofy Toos. Well, Skullwoods did have also the bow. The bow is in the front. So, bow and mitt. Very nice. Let's just celebrate this moment by opening up the big chest. And I guess we'll go do all of Thieves. Gnarly, dude. Well, that was pretty... Pretty schlick. Yeah, it is very nice to get these done in one shot. It sucks that at some point I do need to go back and do... Um... Uh, Zelda Cell, maybe? But... I'm going to hold off and do that with uh, Castle Tower, if it comes to it. nice to get early. Yeah, I think that'd be something else that I would do with these settings next time, is starting with the compass. Or even, well, starting with all the dungeon items would be silly. Oh my god, please die. Sir? right here. Another heart. I think the front of Thieves Town is like one of the worst areas for this mode. It is such a pain in the neck finding all these enemies. Hidden blob up here. Yeah. I'm like, where is he? Get over here. I don't need it. There's still another enemy, another hidden enemy up there. Oh, I know where he is. He's right up the stairs. Okay. 
Moving on. <laughs> Takes so long just to do four rooms. Last time I, made, I played this mode, it was this plus all pots, and boy, it was a lot. Another heart, okay. Cruising. Yeah, we don't need to kill those bats. They don't count. Most flying enemies don't count. Now, in an atomizer, it's different, but... A bottle. The second bottle. had a lot of health in it. And that's pretty much it. I'm playing bad. I'm dying here. Oh, I'll get the boomerang. I guess. I'm not bad. You're bad. Hey, money. Powder, you say? Thank you. That's better. I don't deserve the shabby treatment. Chat's not bad. Chat's cute. It also helps that we got early bow, early fire rod. So we're not isolating certain enemies in dungeons that we can't kill. I have a block. I'll go to shield. Great. Alright, it's another dungeon done. We got Burna, we got Powder. We got a lot of hearts. I think we doubled our entire HP. Just like that. That's another dungeon done. Um, I guess I'll grab this man. Mm 
Mirrorless Smith. Now, I could just go do all of Palace of Darkness. But I don't want to. Especially not without a lamp. Yeah, in a mode like this especially... Honestly, I wish this rando had a way for you to prioritize certain checks. Like, in a way that it would guarantee that there's something useful in certain checks in a mode like this. Just, just to kind of balance stuff out a little bit, you know? It's one thing I liked a lot about um, Mystic Quest rando is that you can set certain locations to be either just like generally included but or to prioritize so there's always a guaranteed tracker item on uh, a spot if you want it because i mean not all locations are created equal some are a lot more annoying being guaranteed to get good items on the annoying checks is nice ap can do that yeah, but... Yeah, well, uh, that's good. I think I did that, and I'm doing that for my Zooter, I think. I think I have it set up so that it'll guarantee some good items. Yeah, right, because the last time I did Zooter for AP Multiworld, I had it set up so basically every dungeon major item chest was a randomized item. It's an example of a place you deprioritize. Oh yeah, it's Vanilla Swords. Don't. So I don't even care about the pedestal. Well, I forgot. Sample of a place you deprioritize. I don't... I, I'm not necessarily saying there are places that I want to deprioritize, but there are places that I would like to prioritize in a setting like this. Okay, what do I want to do? I could just sequence break into ice. Um, this is interesting though. Oh, I completely forgot to do this. I kind of want to sequence break up the mountain, but. I think with this early dark world, there's probably going to be something in the pot in pod. So I think I'm going to go to pod next. I would prioritize like purple chest. In a mode like this, I would either prioritize purple chest or just like force junk on. So maybe that is a location I deprioritize. It's just interesting in this scenario where um, there is pretty much anything that's not within a dungeon feels like a bad check. It just feels like a waste of time. To me, at least. You know, I part of me was thinking that these, this early mitts to get an early sword upgrade from the smith is like potentially sending me into castle tower. But man, I'd like to see I'd like to see that lamp before I or I go for that kind of line of thinking. It's kind of sucks to go to pod, go to a pendant dungeon. I mean, I do have a beatable out of logic ice palace. <laughs> but who knows, maybe early bow is also sending me here. Yeah, never know. Uh, 
things that I'd like to see soon would be lamp. Um, mirror. If I get a hook shot, I'm just gonna go up the mountain. Yeah, I remember there's a red idiot right here. Now there are three red idiots. All right. Not cast bombos while they're. Or I can't cast any medallions while there's a bomb out. Okay. That's better. Um, I think I'm going to skip this for now. There is a weird situation here where I could be forced to go towards the back of Pod to find the big key. I think that happened in my last one as well. Okay, well, there's another sign to pointing towards Castle Tower. Yeah, boy! You know what? I'm going to make that assumption again. Because it got me good last time. Okay. Well, there was a key. But then again, this is a situation where I might just need that mirror and there's nothing else in here. Uh, but, I mean, this mirror doesn't really do too much for me until I find my lamp. But I think this will probably send me over to... Probably sent me over to Castle Tower. Honestly, I might not even kill Helma here. I don't know. We'll see. If if Big Key shows up right now, then I'll do it. Oh! <laughs> yeah! Oh, uh, that's a good item. trying and we got silvers out of it because i know that the pet is dead and well it has a sword on it i think i'll probably skip the helmet kill
love. Bummer. Anything else in here? Yes, there is. Okay. <laughs> nice lamp. Well, definitely made this uh, a lot harder than it needed to be. That's okay. It's a video. in moi. <laughs> All right, I'm out. See you, Helma. You get to live, mister. Interesting is like I could go to Castle Tower. But I'd much rather go up the mountain. I don't even know how many items Castle Tower actually has with uh, all the enemy drops. It also doesn't help that I never checked what was at uh, Lumberjack. So this just feels like a all-around bad play. It's too high? Nah. Alright, whatever. It's only 34. Okay. Let's see what we can find out of here. Well, there's two out of three keys. those things where I would have much rather gone up the mountain, but I had already, like, decided in my head that this is where I was gonna go, so I have to- I gotta stick with it. And we got a heart piece. It's pretty good. Oh, 
Oh, okay. All right. That is required. Okay. All is well. We made the right choice. Ooh. Ooh, wee. And a book? We got both of our desert entry items. Gotta say, these silvers are great. Gotta say, this number's not adding up. Hmm. Oh well. Wonder who I missed? That's weird. I missed somebody. Honestly, I think one of those staircases had an archer and a blue guard. The last dark room had three, and I got all three of them. All right, well, we have a lot we can do now. Refresh? I'm refreshing. Yo! Oh, that jumped up a lot. Holy moly. Yo, shouts to Anonymous. It's a big 250 dono. Thank you, kind stranger. I wonder who it could be. Anonymous has been on fire today, I gotta tell you. Alright, well that's that's huge. It's almost halfway there. Sweat. Oh dear lord. No, I mean, it's fine. BT and I haven't prepared for boss shuffle at all, but it's okay. We're experts. What's up, pool? Wow, we're halfway there. Yeah, 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 I gotcha. I gotcha. All right, let's see if these boots were actually required for anything. Thank you, Anonymous. Boy, these silvers are great, I tell you what. Leapers? Okay, we just need a hookshot and cane, and the boots were not required. that big key. It's 
probably gonna be like in the main lobby or something. There's my compass. Thank you. Okay. All right. We just need. Jeez. Can't believe. I'm getting all this help for this community async. Unbelievable. I'm basically cheating. Unreal. I think I just need hookshot for go mode. No, you didn't pull float. It's all good, dude. This isn't a super serious race. Wow. What's even funnier is that you were wrong. Alright, I just need to find a hookshot. Hookshot across a bunch of random item locations. Can't wait for it to be in Zelda Cell. I can't believe I'm getting called out for not telling chat that I don't like backseating. Hmm, wow. It's almost like it's in the standard rules. But what do I know? This is my first stream ever. It's a bell zone. Seat is going great. I am a hookshot from Gomo. Actually, this. That's a cow. I can't do that. Or at least I don't know how. No one's taught me. You seem to be an expert on that, 26 pandas. I like cows. I like it when they go moo. It's a seed requirements. Feel you need a hook shot. I mean, I still need, of course, like the big keys and dungeon items, but they're not shuffled outside of their dungeon. I just need a hookshot that guarantee that I can beat my last dungeon. First stream ever. I did it. I worked real hard for this. I made all the right plays. Though I guess the boots were so far not actually required, but boy, I tell you, they've been nice. And this is the perfect place to look for a hook shot, in my opinion. In fact, this is my favorite place to look for a hook shot. Nope, only mushroom. Nope, Chuck tested. You think just because you were near an earthquake in New York that you deserve to backseat as a treat? You're talking to somebody that lives in California. Oh, you were pooping. Okay, you can backseat as a treat. Couldn't imagine a horror such as that. Shook the shook the toilet. Oh, chat's dead. Never mind. 
There. There's your back seat. Oh my god, this guy's too good. This guy's got me figured out. Yeah, I should probably do something fancy for my six-year sub. Stream anniversary. My Twitch partner anniversary. Whatever shall I do? Did I do anything last year? Got six months to figure something out. Hmm. Oh baby, the mirror shield. Sounds like I got six months six months to put out a bunch of emotes. I'll get right on that. Oh my god, you stupid idiot, get out of the way. Don't worry, chat be gone will be released after five minutes. Don't worry. You'll get your chance to backseat here shortly. See, I would prioritize this check if I could. But then again, I don't I'm at a point for this game that I don't really play it to come up with modes that are like Competitively interesting. I forgot I had ether. I'm just looking for ways to make this game fun. I love fun. I gotta go back and kill one stinking hidden Stalfos. Oh no, wait, he's right here. Got him. Get a buck on him. Oh yeah, I need to check the sick kid. How could I forget about the boy? All right, hook shot. Where are you? Come on, come on. I mean, I know you're in here. Fancy sip. I owe you one. My current coffee is very cold. And many hours, like at least six, maybe seven hours old. So I'm not going to drink it. So. <gasps> no, stop it. Classic chat. Hasta does the opposite of what I say. Or adds insult to injury. Brew some coffee. Now that's what I like to see. Thank you, Zim. I do have a Madrina's cooking in the fridge for me. I'm gonna perish. This is stupid, Meyer. Let's go to Fishbone Room. Or... Two enemies? There's a ghost and a Stalfo... And two Stalfos, I think. Yeah. 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 Honestly, it might be faster... To go this way instead. <laughs> Hook up the bean redemption to my coffee maker. Now nah, you're thinking with portals. here. 
Dang, he did my hook shot. Ah. All right, you're free, chat. You survived. You did it. I'm proud of you. Nobody freaked out either. Yeah, that's where the map was. Bleh. Oh, really? But an earthquake can't affect an airplane? That doesn't make any sense. Alright, all we got out of here was a damn mushroom. There is a door there. It contains, uh, I think nine blue rupees on the floor. It's one of those rupee rooms. A wind quake? Now we're just making up things. Mm. A shark NATO? Keep going, don't stop. Uh, I prefer pot sanity. If I had to pick between the two, I'd do pot sanity. It's just a lot easier. Because with enemy drops, you have to worry about being actually capable of killing enemies. Now, if they started making pots so that they, like, required extra items to, like, pick up a pot or something, then my opinion might change. I'm turning mushroom, and then I'm going to rush Ice Palace. And then I'm going to go get me a Tempered Sword. Do 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 By the way, chat, tonight, in fact, in um, less than two hours, depending on schedule, uh, I'm going to be doing a little combo rando with my good friend in the name of DT. And we have a incentive... To add a little extra shenanigans to up oh, there it is, alright. Alright, that is go mode. Uh we have an incentive to add a little extra oomph in the form of a boss shuffle, which when you think about it is kind of crazy because remember, we're doing two different games, two different Zelda games. And it's a possibility we can make it so that like I'm going through Forest Temple. Let's fight Phantom Ganon. Uh-oh. Phantom Ganon's not there. It's actually Baronade. And then we have to figure out how to get to him as a kid so we can actually beat the boss. Um, That's also going to be interesting because we do have the boss soul option turned on. So, all of a sudden, we're going to be looking for extra bosses as, you know, extra boss souls just to make sure that we cover all of them no matter which one show up. I actually kind of like this change if it gets met because there's so many times we'll be playing the seed and we'll run into a boss soul and we'll get excited and then it just ends up being for one for a dungeon we don't actually have to beat and it's like ah boo so 
so. I would like to see that one get met. If you got any spare change, please consider donating to charity for a good cause. I feel like I played the seed really well. Though, ultimately, I don't think Eastern ended up being required. But the boots have been nice. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, I see that. Then there's a Final Fantasy 1 TAS after this, I think. So I'm probably going to get done with this. I'm, I'm going to get done with this much sooner than I was expecting, so we'll probably... Uh, chill with some... I don't know. I don't know what we'll do with after this. We'll play more Paladin's Quest. Um... I was kind of expecting this to take longer. Stardew? The thing is, I don't really have... All that I have left to do in Stardew right now until I get summer or spring is just kind of like, grow one crop. And I'm like, I don't really want to do that. I, I think I, I am going to wait until I get... Um, my other seasons before I load it back up. There's just not enough stuff to do. And I think the other stuff that I can do is I think I have a lot of quests that are based on care like other characters, so I would have to like do research and figure out what's going on with that. So beat swamp. I'm gonna go get my tempered sword and then we just gotta go speedrun Hera. So, boy, this went really well. I'm shocked. I'm very shocked. Do, 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 do. But, I mean, this is one of those seeds that could go very poorly. If you do the wrong route or whatnot. Like, just think, I'm skipping... I have not been up to the mountain in this seed yet. I have not been up there once. Which is very surprising for me, at least. I have eight checks in logic, yeah. Not that I've been even attempting to try and piece together logic for Stardew. Kind of just like, can I do it? Then I'll do it. I wonder if there is a way to make it so that Joja Mart doesn't get shut down. Because that kind of did put a damper on... I mean, all that did was stop me from getting the early high-quality parsnips, which I ended up getting anyway because I ended up getting something. Oh yeah, I got my seed maker. So I've just been dropping parsnips into the seed maker to get more seeds and then planting them and then rinse and repeat. But also the traveling merchant had parsnip seeds for me, so I bought like 75 of those. It worked out. There are certain mods that will work with AP, uh, but I don't know what they are. I haven't looked into it. Bum bum bum. 
All right, let's go get my tempered sword. Mm. Nah. I don't want it. I don't really need it. It'd be nice, but if I was still looking for items, maybe I'd be a little bit more inclined to check it. I think the big, the real good play in this seed was... Pod. Pod, Castle Tower, all that stuff. Those are all good checks. Because Pod had what? The mirror? Castle Tower had the flute. Plando, the progressive theaters to their vanilla. Yeah, that would probably work. I never even got that far. That must be in like 1.5.6 because I never got to that point in any of my vanilla playthroughs. The movie theater, yeah. Yeah, I just don't remember it. But that's because I don't think I've ever made it to, like, year three. Ever. Movie theater was added to 1.4. See, I don't even know if I played 1.4. I don't remember. I'm talking about Stardew Valley. This still sounds like Splatoon music to me. Okay. Um, I just need to climb with at least two keys because the helm is, the mini helm upstairs is not going to have a guaranteed key. It's still funny because while I did route this seed really well, I did still do a couple, like, awful checks. And I guess technically Eastern was avoidable, but it worked out. Stardew always makes me think I'm wasting time. Oh, like you're not being efficient enough? Or like you're wasting your life in real life? I'm going to do the same thing I did in pod and probably be wrong, but... It's one of those things that if it's here, it's family. It's annoying. The boots were useless. All they did was guarantee I had a good time. Okay. Well, well, well. 
So yeah, now I just want to grab another small key. I mean, I guess it's possible that I might have to spend a key to get more keys. Oh, wait, no, I this, I can just grab this one right here. Never mind, I'm dumb. Ignore me. All right, let's climb. Sometimes you just dumb. I think it's mostly because the last time I played an enemy drop shuffle, it was also a pot shuffle. But it was also a door rando, so... Wow. And watch, I'll probably get a small key on the... on the climb, anyway. But just to clarify, the only thing I knew about the seed going into it was people's finish times. That's it. It's the only info I had. So before you start screaming, cheater! Well, that's nice. There was no way you could get into TR, so that's good. I can't believe Willard cheated in his own community async. How deplorable. Oh my god, this guy's a legend. <laughs> See, look, there were two keys up here. I gained so much information off of... Sam's finish time, it's true. <laughs> I'm just so happy that I actually feel like I got to, like, go mode stuff in this dungeon. It's kind of crazy. Hey, look, another key. Well, dungeon, but also other dungeons. Like, I was not expecting to get to go mode my last four dungeons. At all. It's crazy. Especially in a mode like this. But, you know, to me, it makes me feel like it's kind of the same with boss shuffle. I feel like in modes like this, where you have these logical requirements locked behind needing, like, a bow or a fire rod, or a bombos, that those items will tend to show up earlier. Hookshot was in the Pengator room at the beginning of Ice Palace. So. I crushed it. I crushed it. Now all I have to do is beat up Master Sword Ganon, which is fine, because I have Kane and I have Silvers, so I'm not worried. Watching the, the restream and them doing a PC port Zooter multiplayer makes me want to do one of those again. It was fun when... I need to get DT, Futon, and Locke to do another one. They're breaking the credits.
Good. Good! I can't wait to, wait to read everyone's comments. I almost have enough time there to get a full 12 in. Alright, that should be 12. I will say, fast, the, the whole fast ROM debate when that was up, completely negated by the fact that now Samaria Ganon is, uh, like, easy to do. And doesn't lag the game like crazy. Heckin' fast, Rom. Cannon! Oh, you're being so cheeky. He's so green too. Alright, that's a that is a crazy time. GG's. Wowie Zowie. I like how I initially was just like, I don't need tempered. <laughs> I don't care anymore. <laughs> just, I saw it there, I was walking up to it, and I was like, I have all the other things I need to make this easy peasy. Alright, real quick. I want to read some of the credit, uh, some of the comments. This was one of our community asyncs where I put the seat up. We got a couple of weeks for people to play it, post their times. I already know that I have the best time, which is very funny. Very funny to me. I cannot wait to see my collection rate. Willard J. Bradley. That's me! I had a 1 306. That's that's silly. Um, the next best time, the next fastest time was a 156 from Sean Rhapsody. Sean says, I've done forms of enemy drop before, so was a little more familiar with some of it, though still had some tired brain moments. Uncle started into castle, got a nice start of stuff, slowed down for a while mid-game, decided to do Agatar with Fire Rod and got those goodies. Okay. I put it off until I got Lamp, so made things a lot easier. Then kept following those while keeping in mind it was all Lamp Lock. Go mode was Mirror in Pod, though I didn't realize it at first as my brain kept thinking I needed the Ice Rod. Nice. Never touch DM at all for any checks. Okay, so same. So Sean and I had the same got to skip all of death mountain the thing is i got to go mode he go moded Meyer swamp and hera i go moded ice swamp or yeah ice swamp hera and then gt all right the next best time looks to be a 203 from data plot data plot says had brain fart and ice palace after getting hooked forgot to hit switch and get big keep but other than that things went okay well done data plot then we have a 20455 from Shining Dark 85 who says, Whew! First time trying one of these, I got excited for Go Mode Hook and Ice and totally forgot to hit the switch. Okay, they, they did the same as Data Put. 
Um, overall, it was a lot of fun. I think I actually was helped by being too scared of low percent moth and dying in Thieves Town because it sent me to Penn and Eastern for my boots and pod for the treasure trove there. Well done, Shining Dark. Uh, next up, we have a... That's it for the two O's. Now we have a two, two, two from Aaron Dobe that says, first time enemy drop for me. Hookshot go mode. Had fun except trying to clean out dark rooms and uh, hunting for Zoles in the Thieves Town main area. Yeah, those ones are rough. Only major mistake was dying to Moth early and practically last locating the myths because of it. it. Was nice to essentially go mode three dungeons. True. Yeah, the myths on Moth was really nice. Uh, next up, we have a 225 from Pool Float, who says. Happy with my routing decisions early on, but waited too long for Pod and Agatower. Could have done way, been done way faster. Fair enough. After that, we have a 227 from Post Poetic, who states, Feels bad to have searched for Bombos for Go Mode for 30 minutes when I should have had it early. But went back, went into, went in, but went south into Dark Rooms from Sank Drop and died instead of going north. Ah, that was also in the back. Fire Rod and Bombos were really early. All right, that's it for the two twos. Now we have a 241 from Emok. First time playing this mode as well. This was a fun one. Hyrule Castle was loaded. Didn't go to Agatower for a while, so Flute was pretty late, which led to Flippers and Kane and Desert for Go Mode. Glad I finally got to try one of these. Nice. Thanks for playing, Emok. All right, who else we got? We have a 248 from Sam. Sam wrote a big one up. Hold on. First time doing enemy drop. This mode is hacked up. After getting my go mode hookshot and ice, I started go mode dungeon forgetting that keys exist. Need big key when doing the dungeon the normal way, so big dumb there. Um, someday I'll stop being lazy and learn, relearn Ice Palace Bomb Jump and Icebreaker. Someday. Other than that, I feel like I did mostly okay. Spent some time looking into random caves for enemies and missed mitts for a while because I didn't want to do Moth Healer with four hearts green mail. That is fair. I think I had blue mail by the time I got to Moth. Right. Wasn't blue mail... I feel like blue mail was... Wasn't that also in Skull? Or maybe that was in Thieves. I don't remember. Thanks, Sam. Nice comment. And finally, wrapping it up, we got Maddie. P with a 253 saying probably a bit too much backtracking, but overall not too terrible. Go mode was hookshot and ice. Blue mail and Eastern, I think. Yeah, that might have been it. Yeah, because I got the bow out of skull, got locked in the front, and then went to, and did Eastern right away. The early boots was super nice. All right, I got to write up my comment. Insane time. Wowie. Did Eastern. Bow. Did Eastern pod and CT real early. So had all the goodies pretty quick. Go mode for me was Hook and Ice Palace. Got to go mode Ice Palace, Swamp, Era, and most of GT. Never checked a dang thing on the mountain. Which is pretty nutty. There's my comment. All right, I'm going to hop up real quick, grab a coffee, all that fun stuff. And then we'll, uh, I got, I got an hour to kill. This wasn't supposed to be so quick. Whoops. I want to see this, this, uh, collection rate. 594. Nice.
The uh, the next lowest collection rate was a 604. So, pretty good. <laughs> um, and with that said, I will be putting up a new seed for Async 40 soon. I think it's going to be some sort of cross keys, probably.